Hello there! I'm feeling fresh today. But hey guys, welcome back to my channel! Kung hindi ba naman po halata, eh, kahagaling ko lang sa shower. I just finished taking a bath. So I thought it would be fun for me to try a bunch of new beauty products for you guys. Kasi sobrang dami ko. Ayan, like, this is... And also, I'm gonna show you the skincare products I've been using. Na talaga namang game changer. Na feeling ko magugustuhan nyo. I think yung look ko today, gusto ko medyo brownishy peach siya. Na-miss ko talaga mag-peach, guys. As in, pagpasensyahan nyo na. Tony C can't live without her peach tones. You guys know that. So, quick slide in lang mga sis bago ako magsimula dun sa aking trying out new skincare and makeup. Meron lang akong gusto ipakilala ang app sa inyo na feeling ko matutuwa kayo. It's called Get Contact. So, maglalagay ako ng link kung saan nyo siya pwedeng i-download. Na-feature ko na rin to sa Instagram stories ko and marami sa inyo nagtatanong pa. Basically, Get Contact is a spam call blocking app. So, kung meron kayong i-avoid na spam calls, o hindi kayo sure yun sa number na tumatawag sa inyo, pwede niyang i-block yung mga spam calls nyo. Free lang tong app na to guys and everyone can download it. Meron din siya isang feature na nagustuhan ko na nakakatuwa din na gusto ko lang din i-share sa inyo. Alam nyo ba na pwede nyo makita yung paano nakasave yung names nyo sa contact list nyo sa Get Contact. For example, ako si Tony Sia. Meron nag-save sa number ko as Tony S. Meron din namang Tony the Prettiest Sia and then IG Tony S. Tony YouTuber, tapos may ganun siyang emoji sis. Tony Makeup Sia, tapos meron ditong Tony or Not. So, isa sa mga contacts ko, nag-ano sa akin ng Tony or Not. And then, meron dito my love. Siguro naman si Dave yung nagsabi ng sa akin. Ang cool lang, kasi malalaman mo kung paano nakasave yung number mo sa contacts mo. So, kung yung kuya mo, yung uncle mo, or yung jowa mo. So, if you want to download the app, I'll have the link for you guys. Don't forget to check out Get Contact if you want to block your spam calls. And also, if you want to see how your name is saved in your contacts, but yes, that's it for my mini spiel. Now back to the video. Okay, let's get started. Before I proceed with today's makeup, I want to first do a quick little skincare sesh. I've been trying out these products for like five days na, and I had to tell you guys about it. In fairness, as in what I said to her is hashtag in fairness, um effect siya. Within the five days na ginagamit ko siya, I can't believe na nag-change yung skin ko kasi nag-break out talaga ako every time na it's that time of the month. As you guys can see, hindi naman perfect yung skin ko. But I've had worse breakouts in the past and actually, this is already healing up. Siguro mga four to five days ago, it was much worse. Like, sobrang red ng skin ko and ang dull niya, ang dark din ng pimple mark ko. And meron akong dinatest na skincare line for like the past five days na and so far, so good. Kung yung concerns mo, sis, eh yung acne marks mo, yung pigmentation, basta yung dull ng skin. Parang feeling mo kulang ka sa brightness. So yung ginagamit ko na line for the past 5 days now, these are all firm and it's free kasi tinest out ko rin sila kung okay ba, kung effective ba. Kasi I've been hearing so many good things about it. And I must say, the hype is real, you guys. The hype is real. Yung star product nila is the Innisfree Brightening Pore Serum. Ayan siya. By the way, the packaging is so classy. Parang bronzy, tas white siya. Ito yung star of the show, kumbaga. And ito rin yung feeling kong super talagang game changer. If you had to get one product from the line, it's gonna be this for sure. But I also comes with other supporting products that I feel like work well together as a kit. I'm gonna go through these one by one. Yung ginamit kong cleanser kanina and what I've been using for the past five days now is the Innisfree Brightening Pore Facial Cleanser. Ayan. Something to note, lahat ng products from this range, from this line, merong Jeju Halabok, which helps make the skin look clear and more firm. Nakakatulong talaga siya to brighten the skin then to give you that glowing effect. So, ito muna yung ginamit ko, yung cleanser. Ang bango ng buong line, guys, as in sobrang fruit and nagustuhan ko siya because it's kind of like a creamy cleanser. Sobrang nice sa skin. And it does lather. Hindi din siya yung sobrang tight sa feeling ng mukha. Which alam niyo naman, super ayoko nun. So ito, this one actually is such a good cleanser lang. And parang na feeling ko na energize niya yung skin ko. So ito muna yung first step na ginamit ko. This, however, this magical little potion right here. Ewa ko, ako, ako lang. Pero ang ganda niya. Sabi niya dito, it's brightening, pore caring, and hydrating. It ticks all of the boxes na tama talaga yung claim niya. It comes with a dropper. So I only use about this much for my entire face. Ayan. And it's definitely liquidy kasi nga serum siya. And I just apply this on my face. Like so, ang lightweight lang niya sa balat. Hindi siya unpleasant. Yun yung nagustuhan ko. Kasi minsan yung mga ibang serums medyo sticky on the stickier side. This one doesn't even feel sticky. It's a very comfortable feeling and texture. And it goes on like a dream onto my skin. Ang bilis lang niya i-absorb ng skin ko. So this is how my skin looks after applying the brightening pore serum. As you can see, definitely gave me a glow. And yung pinaka nagustuhan ko sa kanya, it's got vitamin C. I'm a preacher. Preacher ba tawag doon? Basta I preach that vitamin C is one of my all-time holy grail ingredients. Kapagkasali yun sa isang skincare product, nakikitaan ko talaga na result yung skincare product because vitamin C is an effective, effective ingredient if you want your skin just to look overall 
a lot brighter, a lot healthier looking, and for your pigmentation, if you have unwanted marks, acne scars, and hyperpigmentation, nakakatulong talaga si vitamin C. So, ang tuwa ko dito, kasi meron siyang vitamin C, and not only that, triple vitamin derivative, hindi lang siya vitamin C, meron din siyang vitamin B3 and vitamin B5. Ang daming vitamin C. Ito kasi I find na very hydrating din siya kasi meron din siyang hyaluronic acid. So, parang feeling ko, alam mo yun, nabibigyan niya ako ng mas plump na itsura. And as you can see, the light is bouncing back off of my skin. Talaga nabigyan niya ako ng moisturized, hydrated skin while also brightening it kasi nga meron siyang vitamin C. And in fairness naman, guys, within 5 days talaga, I'm gonna be inserting my before picture and then my picture now after 5 days. Nakita ko talaga that my skin was just overall glowing and a lot brighter. Ever since sinas out ko tong buong line, syempre ginamit ko yung buo, like from the cleanser to even the creams and the spot treatment. Sakitaan ko talaga ng tremendous results. But I'm pretty sure even with just the serum, makikita nyo na yung effect na talagang your skin will just look overall brighter. For the next step, I'm gonna be applying the Brightening Pore Spot Treatment. Now, this one naman, yun nga, spot treatment siya. So, I like to apply this on my problem areas. So, right now, I have um, about three that I would like to target. And guys, alam nyo ba, ito, three to four days ago, sobrang pula niya and sobrang laki niya. And by just applying the spot treatment, wala na kaibang spot treatments na in-apply. Nakitaan ko talaga na nag-shrink siya and hindi na siya sobrang pula. You can really see the difference. Ito yung fresh and ito parang natuyo na siya. It's not even as bumpy anymore. Ang iba kong pimples, it just takes so much time before it heals. But this one, napansin ko, na much faster siyang nag-heal and also ang brighter ng itsura. Hindi siya nag-sobrang brown or like nag-turn into this super dark color compared to my other acne marks. Like some of my acne marks I've had for months and makikita mo ang brown pa rin. But this one I've had for 5 days and it's already starting to heal up nung ginagamitan ko nito. I'm also using the Brightening Pore Priming Cream also again with Jeju Halabong Brightening daw, pore caring, and hydrating. With this one, konti lang talaga yung kailangan ko. I don't also wanna overly apply. This just adds a nice hydrated layer onto my skin and feeling ko na seal niya lahat ng mga um, iba ko pang in-apply kanina. Like, yung serum na seal in niya, yung spot treatment na seal in niya, and it just added a layer of hydration. Yung texture pala ng cream, very nice and lightweight. Okay din as a primer substitute. Like, for example, nagmamadali ka lang, kasi smooth out niya yung pores ko. I honestly recommend na kung bibilhin nyo sila, bilhin nyo yung buong set para talaga makita nyo yung buong effect. For me lang naman, worth it yung buong set. Walang tapon from the cleanser to, of course, this amazing serum na talagang nakikitaan mo talaga ng difference, guys. Sinasabi ko sa inyo, napakaganda to even the spot treatment and the cream, they just complement each other and they work well as a set. So, super recommend ko na bilhin nyo sila as a set, as a whole. But if there's, again, one product I would recommend the most, it's definitely the Brightening Pore Serum by Innisfree. It is just so good. If you're looking for a vitamin C serum that actually delivers, ito na. As in, ito na. Antagal ko na rin nagkahanap na vitamin C na effective sa akin and... May nahanap na ako. May nahanap na ako. I'm really, really, really happy. Alright, let's move on to the makeup. So, sa primer muna tayo. Meron din ako mga bagong itatry sa inyo. These are from the brand Touch and Sol. So, Touch and Sol is super famous sa Korea. And even in the States, actually, very, very popular sila. They make some of the best primers talaga. Tried and tested ko na yan since 2017. Kasi nasama to sa aking yearly favorites noong 2017. Touch and Fall No Problem Primer. This is the primer I've used the most this year. Kasi ito yung na-feel ko na talagang nakashank ng pores ko. This is really good. It's very smoothing and it feels really nice on the skin. It's very lightweight. Hindi siya sobrang greasy feeling. It just creates a really nice base before foundation application. So I enjoyed this primer a lot. Touch and Fall No Problem Primer. And they also make my favorite glitter eyeshadow for Ebbs. Like legit, legit, legit. But I also have some other products. Ito yung kanilang No Problem priming water na merong flower water and oil which let's see kung ito nga ba ang gagamitin natin ooh para siyang liquid type ayan liquid type siya Okay, this looks very interesting. And then we also have the No Problem Priming Eraser. Ito yung parang pen na pag ginamit mo, eh, mabilis niya matatanggal yung mga fine lines if ever meron kang fine lines na gusto um, tanggalin. It comes in like a retractable crayon type. So, itatry natin to. And guys, yun nga, sabi ko sa inyo na before, um, sa US ko pa siya nalaman kay Kathleen Lights. Tapos, binili ko pa siya sa Sephora sa US. Pero ngayon, available na siya sa Pinas. Sis, before naalala ko, hindi ko ito ma-recommend kasi mahirap siyang bilhin. Like, nahirapan ako i-link to inyo, nahirapan talaga ako na sabihin kung saan siya available. But now, Touch and Sol is finally available sa Philippines and they're available I think sa Lazada. So, I'm gonna be leaving everything down sa description box. And yeah, I'm trying this out. Tingnan natin siya kung nakaka-array siya ng pores. Yung okay dito, kasi mabilis lang siyang gamitin. You literally, if meron kang line, fine line dyan, ayan, pwede niyong burahin. Nakita niyo ba? Parang na-mattify niyo yung area na yan. 
So, kung meron kang wrinkles or whatever feeling ko minsan sa under eyes, may mga creases tayo dyan, konting ano lang, and it literally instantly blurs those for a smoother finish. Actually, this is really nice, ha? At saka yung nagustuhan ko sa kanya, minimal blending na lang. Kapag drino mo na siya, parang hindi mo na kailangan i-blend. So, feeling ko okay din to pang touch up. So, actually, this is pretty convenient pag gustuhan ko to. But, I also wanted to use their No Problem Primer for today kasi namiss ko to, eh. Namiss ko to mga sis. And ito yung star product nila. Ayan siya. Silicone base to, guys. But, actually, do you see that? It just melts onto your skin. Hindi siya yung sobrang uncomfortable na primer na makapal. Makapal sa balat na uncomfortable. This one actually, mabango siya, sis. And para kang nag-apply ng isang magandang filtered layer sa balat mo na makakatulong talaga to fill in those pores. Ang bango nito, parang hindi ganito yung amoy niya dati, pero parang mas bumango siya ngayon. Sobrang tagal ko na kasi ito hindi na to try. But, again, I really, really love this back in 2017. And it's still the same. It still gave me like that same smooth finish that's now ready for foundation. It's the foundation we're trying out today. This is from Happy Skin. It is their Fresh Morning Dew Foundation. Cooling Water Foundation. I am in the shade Light Beige. And this has SPF 30. Comes in a pump. Ayan. So, parang sabay ang Happy Skin tsaka BLK na naglabas ng kanila. Kanika nilang fresh, fresh line or something like that. Medyo dark siya sa akin. Nasa right off the bat, nakikita nyo na ang puti ko. Tapos medyo orangey. Leans more on the orangey side. I'm not sure kung ito yung lightest shade nila. Medyo thick din yung consistency ng foundation. Thick siya at first, but when you actually touch it, medyo natutunaw naman siya. So, let's just try it out. This cooling foundation features the power of hyaluronic acid, which is famous for its moisturizing properties. It refreshes and soothes the skin for that healthy, dewy look. So, dapat na meron siyang dewy finish. Wala. Wala siyang amoy. So, I'm just using a brush to blend it out on one half of my skin para makita natin. Right off the bat, it's got light coverage. Kasi andito pa rin yung aking blemish. Nandiyan pa rin, kita mo pa rin yung aking imperfections. It's a light coverage and it definitely has more dewy finish. It's not like an oily, dewy type of finish. Medyo manageable yung dewiness niya. If you have oily skin, you can easily set this with a powder. And actually, sabi ko kanina na medyo dark siya sa skin ko. Ano? Light coverage lang kasi siya at dahil light coverage siya, mabilis siyang nag adjust sa aking skin tone. You might need to apply a lot more than your typical amount of foundation. <laughs> Gets ba? Tama English ko sis. So far naman, in fairness, it's really really easy to blend. Hindi naman ako nagkakaproblema. I'm switching to a sponge to ensure that everything is well blended. Foundation is on and in fairness naman sa happy skin, um, noong una I was kind of worried kasi yung feeling niya sa skin ko parang hindi ko alam kung didikit ba nang maayos sa balat ko. But it did give me a nice, light coverage, dewy-dewy look. Yung coverage niya more of on a tinted moisturizer level lang. So if that's what you like in your foundations, I think this is nice. I still have to test it out for the entire day but so far, I'm not hating how it looks. Yung consider ko guys, um, hindi siya bago. It's just like a trees, what's this, camouflage concealer. So I'm just gonna apply a little bit of concealer wherever I need it. Now, for my eyebrows, I'm gonna be using the Essien Co. Brow Refiner. Ganda lang talaga nito. So far, ito yung nahanap ko na closest to Glossier Boy Brow na maganda yung kanyang filling in properties. And I'm using the shade Ash, which is yung parang medyo black nila na shade. And I'm just softly coating my eyebrows and filling my brows. Makikita nyo naman yung difference. Kung meron naman kayong eyebrow hairs to begin with, gusto nyo lang na ma-amplify yung mga hairs niya. If you want, again, a quick filling in moment with your eyebrows, brow mascaras are really gonna be your best friend because it's so easy to use. Moving on to the next product. Ito nabili ko sa Lazada, guys. These are the BLK Fresh Creamy All Over Paint. I have two colors, Coco Crush and Feeling Peachy. Ito si Coco Crush, ito si Feeling Peachy. I just wish Coco Crush was a little bit more brown kasi medyo parang ang red tone niya. But I'm gonna try Feeling Peachy today kasi para lang magmatch dun sa ating look. So ito si Feeling Peachy. Actually, I love these BLK Creamy All Over Paints kasi really pigmented and easy to blend like okay sila with that dewy skin with that skincare primer foundation combo with this one my skin looks really fresh like i'm really digging this light coverage look mm, juicy juicy skin
Wow, so nice, guys. Ang ganda. Ang ganda. So, fire and fairness, ang ganda. So, like, that was really easy to blend. I'm gonna use cover girl powder. Wala kasi akong bagong powder to show you. Just to set lightly lang on my face. Para hindi lang tayo sobrang mahirapan sa paglalagay ng bronzer natin mamaya. Oh, alam mo ba? May glow pa rin siya. Hindi na wala yung pinaka-glow niya. And yun yung gusto ko mangyari. Ayoko naman na sobrang mawala lahat ng mga pinaghirapan ko. Like, may glow pa rin, oh. I'm using Flower Beauty Heatwave Luminous Bronzer. Parang first, first time ko ba itong mapakita? Yeah. This is gorgeous. Kasi meron siyang shimmer particles na maganda sa balat. I'm using it with a Kind Beauty Bronzer Brush. This is one of my favorite brushes right now. The reason why I love this brush is that it's so easy to use. Makes bronzer application a breeze. Swak na swak siya sa aking cheekbones. At ang bilis niyang gawin yung three. Diba? Like, nabibilis na ako dito. Pag ginagamit ko itong pang bronzer, tapos na ako mag-bronzer and parang sobrang bilis lang. Now, I'm moving on to my eyes and I'm using the Juvia's Place um, The Magic Mini Palette. Ito siya. I bought this in the States and naka-sale siya for like 600 pesos, something like that. So, binili ko na siya kasi mag- Binili ko siya kasi ang ganda ng colors niya. Again, I wanted to do like a terracotta -y, peachy kind of vibe. So, I'm gonna try to use itong mga shades. I'm gonna try to use yung mga peachy tones. So just did like a basic eyeshadow look. Now I want to show you like again, sabi ko sa inyo yung favorite kong shimmer ever. This is probably my favorite na single eyeshadow that was ever created on planet Earth. These are the Metalist Foiled Pigments by Touch and Soul. They sent me these pero meron na ako yung ibang mga shades. Favorite na favorite ko sila as in sobra guys. Kakaiba. Iba yung shine nila. Mahilig ako sa mga single eyeshadows. I have so many brands but these ones just sparkle a lot different. As in iba. Iba yung translation nila sa mata. Pakita ko lang sa inyo guys because napaka just simply the best. I've used these so many times. This is Persian Rose, for example. And as you can see from the pan, palang alam mo ng iba. I'm doing one press, and that is the color you get. And this is the translation. Like, hmm. Ganyan siya. Ganyan siya ka-intense. Ito, isa sa mga favorites ko. This is Honey Brown. Ibang klase, guys. This is Honey Brown as in grabe talaga, guys. As mmm. Grabe, di ba? Kakaiba. As in, wala kong eyeshadow na ganito kaganda. Sinasabi ko sa inyo, like, one of the best, if not the best product of Touch and Soul. Ibang klase. Mm. Finger lang yung gagamitin ko dito, ha, guys? Kasi sanay ako na finger yung ginagamit ko. And I'm using Honey Brown. konti lang to, guys. As in, pero yung impact nila, eh, ang lala talaga. Wait. OMG. Wait lang. Oh my gosh. Simply the best. As in, simply the best. Siyempre may fallout to guys. Hindi siya, hindi ako magmamalinis. Ang sasabihin ko, wala tong fallout. Meron kahit paano kasi parang pigment siya na prinest lang eh. Pero alam nyo, sobrang ganda. If you try to scatter these, the dimension is gonna give your eyes is sobrang as in international level talaga. So ngayon ang gagawin ko, I'm gonna be misting yung eyeshadow na ilalagay ko sa aking lower lash line. I'm gonna be using the So Natural Powder for Room All Day Tight Makeup Setting Fix. Ayan siya. Ito yung ni Rave About Me, Ray, tsaka ni May, na parang na-cures din ako and super bestseller din daw to sa Korea. So, gamitin ko muna to to wet my eyeshadow. Not that I need some more wetting, just on the lower lash line. Let's try to wet it. Ooh, that's a fine mist. And then I'm gonna be using cream peach on the inner corner para lang bonggalicious talaga tayo. As in like, itodo na natin to. Itodo na natin tong kagandahang to. Char. Cream peach on my inner corner. Yes, these are glittery tears. Charot. Ayan na siya, guys. Ayan yung touch and soul na pigment. And as you can see, 
As in, di ko na kailangan sabihin. Now, I'm gonna be using a Queen New York Waterproof Pen Eyeliner. I got this from YesStyle. And, asya, like, it's just a brown eyeliner na liquid na brush tip. So, brown para hindi naman tayo sobrang mahirapan. And, ang tagal ko na hindi naga-eyeliner, guys. Please pray for me. Did I do that? <gasps> okay, I think I did that. So this is the finished eyeshadow eyeliner thing. I'm gonna be right back with my mascara. Mago mascara lang ako. Hindi lang ako mago falsies, guys, kasi nasa bahay lang naman ako. And then I'll be right back for the rest of my makeup. So for the lips, I'm gonna be doing like a Korean gradient moment. I'm gonna be using my concealer lang, and I'm just gonna conceal a bit of my upper lip. Actually, upper and lower lip, pala. And then I'm gonna be using the same BLK Creamy All Over Paint in Feeling Peachy. Applying on the center. Ang bango nito ah, may peach. In fairness. Ngayon ka lang realize. Tapos, para nakukulangan ako, I'm gonna be using Happy Skin. This is Fresh Morning Dew Cooling Lip and Cheek Tint in the color Sunrise. Tapos, ilalagay ko lang din dun sa pinaka-gitna. So, this is the finished makeup look. But, of course, I still wanna try this one. So, ito yung ganyan ginamit ko na setting spray for my eyeshadow to stick better onto my lower lash line. And that was really effective. Ito yung So Natural Powder for Room. All Day Tight Makeup Setting Fix with Double X. Ayan siya. Bale, ito yung kanilang super sikat na setting spray. Nakita ko na yung mist niya kanina. Napakaganda. But, I'm still gonna try it out for you guys. Oh my gosh. Kita nyo ba yan? Continuous siya. Kahit na isang beses mo lang siyang i-press, tuloy-tuloy na yung mess niya. So, I'm gonna try this onto my face. Wow. Oh my God. Angelic. That mist was so nice. And again, one spray lang to. Ulitin ko lang. Shoot. Ang ganda nun! Ang ganda! Isang beses ko lang siya kailangan i-press. Hindi mo siya kailangan ni pss, 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 pss. Hindi. Isang beses lang. Tapos, andyan na yung mist. Glass Skin Central. Glass Skin Central. Wait lang, patuyuin ko lang to sis. Nakary the way ako doon. Sobrang ganda nitong mist na to. Yung all day tight. Oh my gosh. Okay. This is really, really something. I'm so excited to use this even more. But I'm just gonna wait for my makeup to dry and I'll be right back. So, ito na yung final look, guys. I hope you liked it. Sobra nagustuhan ko siya. And alam niyo kung ano yung tumatatak sa akin. Yung skin. More than the eyes, more than the lips. It's the skin talaga na tumatatak. Kasi sobra nagustuhan ko yung combination talaga. Yung skincare na in-apply ko. And then, yung primer na in-apply ko. Tapos, yung foundation. Ang gandang combination nun. So, like, ang ganda lang talaga. Parang sobrang mukhang natural ng skin ko. Naturally peeking through. Pati yung blush, ang ganda rin ng kapit sa balat ko. Ewan ko nakikita nyo. Pero, sobrang natural and sobrang healthy looking niya. I know this is not a new look for me. Just wanted to try out some new products na hindi ko pa natry before. To be honest, lahat ng mga tinay ko ngayon ay napakaganda. I'm so happy na natry ko to ulit yung Touch and Soul No Problem Primer and then the mist. The mist was beautiful. As in, sobrang ganda. I can't wait to use this even more kasi, like, it just melted everything together and see that, see that glow. I love and the primer as well was so nice. I mean, of course, the eyeshadows were amazing. Try this out. As in, you will not regret it. The shine on my lids, so beyond amazing. Actually, the Happy Skin Foundation also, I really, really enjoyed. Maganda. As in, napakaganda. Parang skin-like lang. And hindi siya heavy sa balat. And the BLK Creamy All Over Paint. Nagustuhan ko rin. Like, napakaganda. And guys, don't forget, if you are looking to try, of course, an effective, effective brightening kit, for your skin, if you want to lighten your um, dark spots or like your hyperpigmentation or whatever, definitely try the Innisfree Brightening Pore Line. And I'm gonna have the links of all the products I mentioned, the makeup and also the skincare that I use today. But yes, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Sana enjoy nyo yung aking pa makeup session. Pa try new makeup. Guys, sa tuyo na yung buhok ko sa sobrang tagal ko nag makeup dito. Shout out. But thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found some helpful recommendations. Don't forget to tag me on Instagram with the hashtag T Shopping and with the hashtag Tony C. Maybe buy it. If you purchase any of the items I mentioned and I recommended. But thank you so much guys for watching. I love you so much. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Comment down below what you want to see next on my channel. And I'll be seeing you guys on my next one. Bye!